dual degree program in energy provides an opportunity for students to get the aspects of engineering required for the energy sector. This essentially combines mechanical, chemical and electrical engineering subjects that are relevant for the energy sector. We have a series of coursework, fundamentals and applications. We also have an innovation lab, an energy design project and then the dual degree project. With these, the students who go through this program are really equipped to meet the challenges and opportunities of the energy sector. Hi, I'm Aniket. I'm a final year dual degree student in Department of Energy Science and Engineering. Hi, uh, I'm Shiva. Hi, so I'm Chitrangana and I'm a third year undergraduate from the Department of Energy Science and Engineering. I've also been the internship coordinator, looking after internships uh, for my department, Energy Science, uh, for the past one year. Hello, my name is Suditi Ladda and I am a fourth year dual degree student. Hi, my name is Ashish Shukdeve. I am a final year dual degree student in Energy Science and Engineering Department. Hey, I'm Suraj and I'm fifth year undergraduate in Energy Science and Engineering, which is a DD program. And over the tenure, like uh, over my stay in IIT Bombay, I have explored a lot in energy science and so recently I have been uh, the secretary of uh, my department and I have been contributing in other fields as well as such as the IVR overall coordinator for energy day. So my MTech thesis is feasibility analysis of hyperloop. Now hyperloop is a technology in which capsules would be traveling in a vacuum uh, tube and they would be traveling at a speed of sound that is around 200 km per hour. So it's a disruptive technology and we are trying to analyze the, analyze the technology from energy point of view. For that we have also collaborated with the government of India and we are trying to do the real life scenario on Mumbai Pune route itself. I am running the virtual machine uh, on the FPJ board here and I am giving the control signal from Arduino for my project work. Uh, as you can see right now I am just building my model on the fabricated board. As so I am working on a smart distribution system and its grid support capabilities under Professor Zakir. So I am currently trying to uh, see whether we can uh, utilize the distribution network which is currently being integrated with distributed generation that, that they can support the uh, main grid or not. Uh, it's a beautiful campus in the heart of Mumbai unlike other IITs which are placed way, way outside. Uh, it's a small campus I would say, I mean with a radius of 2 km so you can get to wherever you want to go in 10 to 15 minutes. There are a lot of extracurricular activities that happens in our institute that we get to take part in uh, like uh, Pratham which is a satellite team, uh, ITB racing team which makes their own racing car to take part in an international competition, Rakshak they participate in drone related competitions and Team Shunya which I was part of. So in Team Shunya, Team Shunya represented India in Solar Decathlon uh, 2014 in France the first time. We were the only participant from India uh, and recently in 2018 in China. And the next team is now working to take part in the next upcoming SDC competition. Uh, the main objective of our, the competition is to make a net zero uh, solar powered house and which, which is made up of uh, sustainable materials. The whole house is constructed within 14 days on site and we have to make it first in India and then dismantle it and ship it back to the competition site and rebuild the house there. So I feel that the 5 year course that we have actually gives us the relevant time required to explore different topics and after that, after 4 years of our studies, we have this dual degree project where we can actually research into the uh, topic that we really find interesting. In our department, we have to do a lot of electives and we also have a very wide uh, choice to select from. And also you get a lot of opportunities for internship because energy is an integrated field and almost uh, every internship opens for us. I would like to specifically talk about the dual degree program. Now in dual degree program, since you get one additional year, you can do additional activities in the institute. Now that might include an internship or taking up some PO position of responsibility in your fifth year or even actually going for a semester exchange in your fourth year. 
which might not be possible for a BTEC student. Also, uh, since most of the universities have started recognizing MTEC equivalent to the MS, you can directly apply for PhD after uh, doing the dual degree program over here. So we have a really good uh, student to teacher ratio along with uh, the required uh, dedicated labs for research uh, and as part of our uh, curriculum we also have uh, various course projects and, and one seminar uh, which also helps us uh, in exploring and uh, we also complete this uh, course, uh, our post graduation in just uh, 5 years as compared to the normal 6 years. Uh, this program is a unique blend of uh, electrical, mechanical and chemical engineering. It was uh, created by ITB to meet and manage the energy requirements of our country. People over here work in uh, various fields ranging from batteries, fuel cells, PV to uh, solar thermal energy and energy management or energy policies for our country and, and power systems and power electronics. Those are the main topics over here. So you see that we have a lot of flexibility in terms of department electors that are nearly around 13 courses that you can select uh, based on what you like. So it gives an opportunity to explore yourself and see uh, where what you really like. So I would say that's pretty flexible curriculum which is not available in other departments to such a large extent. And it also being a five-year program, the laughing within the last day, it gives you additional opportunity to explore other things if you have missed out in the first four years. I think the salient feature of the department is that it is a hybrid mix of mechanical, electrical, chemical and a little bit of environmental department as well. So within this course you get to get, you get exposure of a wide variety of topics and you can actually find out where your interest lies. Moreover, as I have said that uh, the department is a very close-knit family because of which this actually exploring different avenues becomes much easier. Since India is in need of both affordable and clean energy right now, I think it's a very good time to uh, get into this energy sector. Uh, also, our curriculum uh, uh, is an amalgamation of uh, electrical, mechanical and chemical uh, curriculum. So, it actually empowers you to uh, you know, work in uh, such a diverse environment, such a, diver such a diverse field. Uh, the department lets you explore and grow whatever you want to be. Such kind of diversified options you don't have in other programs. And also, the campus is in Mumbai, so you can study and, you know, party here. You get to meet different people here. They come from all parts of India and they have different backgrounds and cultures. And also, you can do a minor here and you can select uh, your minor from electrical, mechanical, computer science, etc. I think it's not a big surprise that energy is going to be one of the big sectors that is coming up in near future. So when you study renewables which our department offers, it's pretty good and in the future it will be really helpful. As well as if you want to, since it gives you 5 years, if you want to explore yourself, then you can join the department.